Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. And today we have the farmer's market, the wholesale market actually. I'm just showing you a bunch of stuff that they have. This is in Tampa. You have all your herbs. This is your thyme. Dill. And what's this? Rosemary, I believe. Yep, rosemary. I have no clue what this is. That's what that looks like. So what I do guys, when I don't know what something is, I just come here and I like to look at some of the stuff that they have. This is bok choy, but this is actually, I've never seen the small ones. So these are the small bok choy. I think I'm saying it right. And I get these are the medium ones. See, these are a little bit bigger. And what's this? I have no idea what that is, but this is what it looks like. This is greens in the green family. These are sugar peas. And what's this? Chives. Now, I didn't know this is how chives look. And of course, celery. Let's see what this is. Lotus roots. Hmm. Okay. Oh, look at those little bananas. And this is basil. And you have Chinese bitter lemon. It's right here. And when we first moved to our new house, we found a bunch of these growing and we had no clue what they were. But they're actually bitter lemon. Over here you have the long squash. And gober roots. I'm not sure what it is for. And then this is lemongrass. In Jamaica, we call it fever grass. You boil this when you're having a temperature and it drops your temperature. Everybody know this is okra. I don't particularly like that. And then we have squash. And we have cucumbers for pickles. And then over here, these are the Persian cucumber they're smaller and a little they're not as bad all right here we have the yellow turmeric and the ginger root wait a minute this is ginger i'm not sure if that's ginger yep that is ginger also Some jumbo carrots. This is humongous. All right. In Jamaica, we call these pumpkin squash. But that's what that is. Rutabaga. Almost looks like turnip. This is beets. And here are your turnips. And then here are some more. This is radish and these are beets, golden beets. And I guess they're a little bit different because these are the regular beets. These are the regular beets and these are the golden beets. This is green loba. No clue what that is radish. Right here we have, what is this? Horse ra horse radish. Hmm, didn't know that's how it was grown. And I'm not sure what this one is. What is this, Kiki? What is that one? It's a low box. Low I have not. And why is this thing in this? Probably keeps it fresh. Feels nice though. This is Nag Naga Emo. And I'm probably saying it wrong. Oh. And this is Korean Lot Bok. Whatever that is. 
Okay, let's go over here to the Yucas. Yucas, this is in the Yam family, like cassava. This is Malanga Coca. Alright, now this is yam, yellow yam. Now this I know. Yellow yam. They have this in yellow, white. Um, let's see what else. That's it. White yam. This is but it's a different kind of white yam. This is Hawaii white yam. This is Jamaican yellow yam. And Japanese red skin. Probably like sweet potato. I think, yeah. This is This is what this looks like. Let's see. Alright, over here we have oh Thai eggplant. This is tiny. Yes. Wow. another eggplant, Chinese eggplant. Now these are the regular micro eggplants that I'm used to. Then these are chili pe pepper hatch chili. Whatever those are. And these are peppers. see what's over here. I'm not going to go through the whole store. Oh, wow. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? I have no idea what that is. That is pretty. Oh, wow. Oh, that's the top of the banana tree. Is it? And do you eat that? I guess. Oh, wow. I want to buy one. I didn't know you could eat that. And what is this? Oh, Chinese okra. Wow. I didn't even know there was such a thing. It feels kind of hairy. Right? And what is this? I have never seen half this stuff. That's some of the prices. No, that's kind of expensive. I know what this is. Brussels sprouts. Let's see what we have here. Parsley. Curly parsley. You can tell the difference. And that's Italian parsley. That's Italian. That's curly. This is a spinach bunch. I didn't even know they sold spinach like that. And what is that over here? What is this? It looks like this looks like celery. Rhubarb? I don't know what that is. What is that used for? Oh. Collard greens, broccoli. Now we all know those. And that's kale back there. Cauliflower, I've never seen orange cauliflower and purple. I'm learning a lot today. Artichoke, never had that. That doesn't look too appetizing. Oh, wow. This is, I'm not sure what this is. Looks like some kind of cabbage. I think it's a kind of cabbage. We have some chestnuts.
so over here we have dates dried apricot this is tamarind this is sour it's an acquired taste but you can make a drink from this and it's very good if you have issues going to the bathroom that is very good get you some tamarind juice and you will go and we have some sugar cane here i didn't know they had sugar cane here all right over here we have coconuts this is this is the, how the coconut is off the tree and this is what's inside of a coconut if you don't know and there's water coconut water in there that you could drink this is called bread fruit. This is from Jamaica. Well, we have it in Jamaica. I'm pretty sure you have it other places, but this is bread fruit. You could roast it. You could boil it. I like it roasted. Boil is not my cup of tea. What is this? What's this? Jujube apple? Is that what that is? Wow, that's tiny. Never seen that before. These are actually very good. I don't know what it's called. It says Rubitin, but I don't know what, if that's what it's called. But these are good. These are dates. Huh? What? This is called Ginep. I forgot what it's called. I know it's, that's not the name. I know it as. These are ginnets. These are good. You pop open the green. I think that's what it is. So yeah, lychee, lychee. You pop this open and you suck them, and they have a seed. Alright. I don't know what that's kiwi. Is this just a jumbo kiwi? This is mainly. Nice. Is that a jumbo kiwi? Yeah. It feels the same. Oh, this is sour sap. These look a little bit rough. But that's good. You make that into a drink. I don't know what. Oh, what is that one? Actually, this looks like the another sour sap. It's a little different. This looks good. Why is it in this little um, styrofoam thing, though? Of course, your pineapples. Look how big these mustard eye grapes are. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah but my, no. Ours are better at home. Let's see how much these mustard eyes are. Let's see. $5.99 per pack, $42 for the case. Or, and it's not even hardly anything in here, seriously. We need to open up a business and have people come by and pick uh, our muscadine grapes. This is pomegranate. What is that? Dragon fruit. Dragon fruit? How do you eat it though? You probably have to wait till it's right. I don't know. When it's probably softer. Okay, and now this right here, these are jackfruits. Sorry. Let's get, see if we can get over here. Now this is good. A lot of vegetarian or vegans eat this and they you make it like and it tastes like meat almost i don't know how true that is but they're hard you have to wait till they get soft and this is just the wholesale section you got your plantains cactus tuna pear Wow, and then those are the red ones. I wonder how you eat them. One day I'm gonna come and buy a whole bunch of different things. Avocado, chayote, or we call it chocho in Jamaica. Uh, this is, I have no idea what this is. It's 
that's the name. We all know what this is. If you don't know, this is aloe. Green bananas, of course. And what is this? Um, papaya. Cactus. This looks like cactus. I don't know what it is. Some kind of cactus. Will people eat these? Yeah. Uh, no, that doesn't look appealing. Wow, it was cold back there. Yes. And so here they have, if you have a restaurant, you could buy all your... Stayed in the store too long. 